Professor Buggy. Buggy. It certainly is. I think you're right. You find my tortoise so funny, but I don't mind because I like making people laugh. We just think you're amazing. We, don't we, Daddy? we definitely do. And look how gorgeous she's looking in her nice top, Daddy. It is wonderful, isn't it? I mean, she always looks gorgeous anyway, but this is extra good. It is extra good. It's all black and white. That's right, because you're always chasing rainbows. Cupcakes and rainbows, I like both those things. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Now then, madam, what have you been doing this week? I've been doing all my usual things. I've been doing some lessons. It'll be holidays soon. Holidays? You haven't had nothing I was going to say, what's this been? Weeks. I had a Wow. Oh, well, I think it's been a bit more of a holiday than anything else. I think so. I think you'd have worked harder if you'd been at school. But fair play, you have tried to keep some kind of lessons going. You've been very good, all you kids. Yeah, but summer holiday needs soon, and then we won't have to work at all. We can play and watch tortoises from morning to night. Oh, can you? Yes, you can. No, you can't. Yes, Cartoons you can. Cartoons are strictly rational. I'm not having you turned into a telly head. I won't be a telly head, will I, Daddy? No, your head's wonderful. It's full of all good thoughts. So, have you seen much of Emma Rose and her, and her brothers and sisters this week? Get a fair bit. Some days you've been wet. So, um... I've, I've talked to her on FaceTime when it's been really much. It's not worth going over there. And Auntie Sarah likes some peace and twice sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> well, we haven't been getting much peace and quiet here, have we? Oh, what do you mean by that, Daddy? Well, I've been hearing all kinds of raucous laughter and giggling and all kinds of things coming from the nursery. And it makes you think, what on earth is going on? Especially at meal times. Oh, goodness gracious. It's that Ellie Beth, the little Evelyn. She's so naughty. Well, she's not naughty exactly, but she's um, tubby a little bit, Mr. Numerous. Oh, I see. A little bit what exactly? Ah, uh, Mr. Numerous. Yes. Uh <laughs> I'm not much wiser. Do you mean mischievous? That's what I said. That's what she said. <laughs> she can be a bit precocious, can that Ellie Beth? What does that mean? Uh, she's a bit of a madam, like someone else I know, isn't she, Daddy? Uh, like you, you mean? Uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> We know about poo. I wasn't going to say that again, Daddy. It's rude. But last week, uh, it was hot in the day, and she wanted to go swimming in the pool where the baby Froddy goes to swim, and the little pigs go to cool off. And she had a swimming costume that Mummy bought for her. So Mummy put her in the swimming costume. Well, she went into water and she was splashing around and she swam quite well even though she's a tiny little baby. And um, she was just swimming past the one place where it isn't tiled properly because um, the, the baby Froggy 
tamale and the piggies like to wallow in mud sometimes he stood for their sticks and peeping that naughty little boy piggy he slid it down the mud and plopped in the water nearly right on top of her and and she got it all her pretty costume all muddy and she sunk in the water and went all spluttering in it. and mummy was just in the going and get her and she turned out of the water she was magic daddy she went right up in the air Whee! like that i know it wow me half to death because i thought she could get got hurt because pippin came in right on top of her but she flew right up in the air like a fairy didn't she she did and do you know what she did daddy i don't know no you tell me when she turned down she turned around and honestly if lots to tell tamari would have been fried to a twist and she said go away dirty little pig or or bet turn you into sausage and eat you for breakfast and it was so funny the way she said it well it wasn't a very <laughs> nice thing to say but it was funny that her baby little mouth coming out and saying that so i had to go and tell her not to say nasty things to her brother but i had to go and tell her brother to say he was sorry for falling on top of her but she is a little mad at the things she comes out with and tell about the porridge uh, we were having porridge for breakfast and she was putting it up in her trunk rather than in a spoon and, and then squirting it in her mouth and then she straddled it but it missed her mouth and she thought that was funny so the next time she straddled it it went all over the ceiling daddy oh yeah, i don't like porridge at the best of times certainly not all over the ceiling well we thought it was funny but mine bert didn't he was really cross but he didn't have to clean it up daddy because she magic it clean oh i see right well but that's good that's what we were laughing at it's never boring in the nursery when Bet's about. <laughs> well, it's a good job she's here to stay. Uh, you can say that again. She's always creating some kind of a sensation. Oh, dear. All right, my princess. Are you about ready for a surprise? Yeah, a surprise. What are you having? Well, what you're having is something. And I've had to take it out of the packaging because it's a special something. And I had to find out how to work it. Now, we're not going to have Daddy touch it because it would scare him. Do you know why? Daddy doesn't like anything that moves. Oh, is it something that moves? Well, just give us a minute and you'll see. All right, Lacey loves it. You ready for this? I've got it right over here so you're not to look. All right, Mummy. What is it? Okay, hide your eyes. I can hide your eyes. Here we just go. Bring it into shot for the camera to see. Look how pretty, Auntie Rhea. Oh, well, that's so cool. What's this? What's this? I'm telling my eyes, I want to see. Oh, Daddy Stacy, what that? Don't you know? You've seen them on YouTube. It's like a, a, a unicorn and a bird and a cat all in one. <laughs> <laughs> I suppose it is because it's got a little pink all over hasn't it isn't it and it's got wings and it's little legs little paws are it's lying down so it's little paws are to the sides of it and it's got um a little mouth and great big glittery eyes uh, what kind of eyes gold eyes uh, they're kind of gold and the pupils in the middle are really really wide with stars that's right and its tail is yellow and... Yellow and green! Yellow and green it is, Mummy. And it's a beautiful... Feel how furry it is. Oh, it's so soft! And why is she standing on a little green star? Well, we'll see, won't we? It's not moving, though, is it? Well, not yet, but do you see that? heart on her. I'm just trying to find it myself now. She's got a little heart on her. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> now she's moving. Didn't you see this? Oh! She's done to spin on the star? She 
is. Now, you know I have to do this first, and then Lacey can do it later. Otherwise, we'll both get all our hands in there. Absolutely. Now, this is called a Pixie Belle, and I've forgotten her name the once. Oh dear, doesn't like it if you don't touch her. And so she'll very soon go to sleep, so we must, must keep touching <laughs> her and making sure she stays awake. I think her name was is Rosie, but I don't remember. There are four different ones. I'll have to make sure... <laughs> Oh, look, she's, if you just touch her and pet her, she stays happy. She's so sweet. She's so gorgeous. Oh, she just how pretty she is. Now, if I... Whoop, she's so sensitive. <laughs> if I can try and hold her back, she'll do something. find her mouth she'll do something else where well, she decides what she won't keep still for me <laughs> still not as rosy ah! <laughs> rosy keep still you're being very bad keep still keep still you see if you can actually find her mouth She'll give you a kiss. Of course, I'm just using my fingers so the camera can see. But she will, if you put her to your cheek, she'll give you a kiss. Now she has four, uh, sorry, three different modes. We're in nurture at the moment. But if you press her little heart, uh, it'll get her, whoops, stop it. <laughs> it'll, it'll take her into the next mode, which is dance. And she'll say cha cha. Now, if you leave her alone, she'll just dance randomly, I do believe. But we can pet her to make her dance. She says, Come on. <laughs> That's so cool. And I think if you tap her, whoops. She is so cute. There are other dances she can do up to six dances. And you can set them off by one clap, two claps, a pet, a tap. I can't do them very well because I'm holding her with one hand. There we go. There was another one that I somehow managed to get right. So should we see her third and last minute? There was another one. Hey, show me the last mode, Mummy. Whoops. Keep still. Hey. <laughs> Whoa, keep still. I love the way her tail moves when she twirls round and round. I'm going to just hold her still so I can get her, find her heart. Right, spin, spin. Now, this doesn't work too well for me because um, you have to make a loud noise to make her spin. So if you put her close to you and talk loudly to her, she will spin for you. <laughs> but if I kiss her, whoops, the longer you kiss her, the longer she'll spin. There we go. She's so cute. She's so cute. <laughs> <Ooh. laughs> Let's put her back onto nurture mode again. If I can find. Keep still. Keep still. Keep still. Keep still. Goodness. She's hot. Keep 
keep still, keep still. There we go. And she says yay yay, which means she's back in nurture mode. Now, do you know why she comes on this little green stand, Lacey? I think you, Mommy! I think you! I think she's amazing! Well, I'll show you something else amazing about her. I'm going to take her off this little green stand and I put her down. And then I'm going to put the little stand inside your t-shirt. Inside my t-shirt? Because... There. I can put her on you. Look at that, see? Oh my goodness! He hit me! He hit me in the face! And I'll show you something even more amazing. Her little tail, if I can do it, can pop right off. There. And if you fasten a little heart onto the little hook, you can wear it like a bracelet. Oh, look at that! Or, and then she won't hit you with it anymore. Or, you can wear it as... A hair decoration. There you are. Yeah, yeah she's telling you you who now because you're not paying any attention to her. And if you don't pay any attention to her in a minute, she'll go to sleep. Look at that, Auntie Rhea. Oh, well, that's cool. Isn't it pretty? Very retro looking. <laughs> uh, very lucky girl, I think. Isn't it pretty? Look. She's going to sleep now. I think she's the most amazing thing in the whole wild world and I'd love to get the others. Daddy, daddy, daddy. Uh, Lucy, that's Lucy, enough Lucy. of that. That's enough of that. One's enough. <laughs> Isn't it, Daddy? Um, well... Nudge, nudge. <laughs> <laughs> we'll think about it. <laughs> Do you like her? I love her. I love her. I can't believe she fits his on to me. Isn't that amazing, Auntie Ria? That is really cool. And she can spin around on you and make you giggle. Mm. It's amazing. Don't touch her, Daddy. You'll wake her up. All right. Anyway, do you like her? I think she's lovely. Thank you so much for such a wonderful surprise, Mummy and Daddy. That's okay. That's all right, my precious. You close us out now, then. We come back to see you again very soon. And in the meantime... Thank you for watching. Have a lovely day. Enjoy your babies. And, and let's be good to each other. Bye-bye.